Good day, fellow riders. I had just finished my second order of the day when the third order that I received, I noticed that it's inside the treasure zone. The pickup and the drop off is also within the zone itself. Usually, when the treasure chest uh, appears on my map, I don't bother with it uh, because it's usually too far away for me. But this time, since it's on my way, I'm going to try it. So, let's go! Seven hundred? Seven hundred? Seven hundred? Yeah. No. No, not yet. Zero, zero, one, go. Let me explain a little bit about the treasure zone thingy to all my viewers and subscribers who are not in the food delivery business. So exactly what is a treasure zone and what is that big chest doing inside the map? A treasure zone right, is a specific area within that green box which you can see whereby you can earn a specific number of uh, gems lah. Uh, so these gems, right, uh, once you collect a certain amount, uh, it actually translates into uh, real world money. So I think it's like uh, 5 cents for one gem and then you need to get like 60 gems. So like 60 gems you collect, uh, you can get uh, $3. So you can see that the base price, right, uh, is like $5.10. So together with the treasure chest, uh, once I deliver to this uh, delivery location, right, uh, that will be an additional, uh, I get 60 gems, so that would be an additional, I think about $3. So I should receive a total of uh, $8.10 for this one single order. Okay, uh, like I mentioned previously, right, uh, this is the first time la, that I'm actually uh, doing a pick up and drop off uh, at the treasure zone. La. So later on I will calculate and let you know la, how much I earn. Uh, eh, wait a minute. La. I think this one is the wrong side. Eh. Oh, must turn. Okay, okay, let me turn. Oh, I think alamak. You see, la, talk, 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 talk. La. Then uh, come to the wrong direction. Uh, it's on the other side. Okay, okay, let me go. So uh, anyway, uh, this uh, treasure zone... Uh, has its own set of uh, rules lah. So uh, I will give a link to the uh, to the grab page uh, description uh, where you what you need to know about this uh, treasure zone, right? If you are going to do the collection for this uh, thing, and uh, what are the rules and regulations uh, governing it? Uh. Uh, one thing to remember: uh, this is different from the incentive gems. Uh. Uh, this is a separate one. So. My advice is go and read up the Grab uh, Treasure Zone uh, FAQ. Uh, then from there you will have a, a good idea. Lah. Okay, so let's go and deliver. This customer uh, requested for contactless delivery. Uh. So let's hang the food, take a picture and go. So I have uh, con successfully completed my first uh, treasure chest. La. So later on, uh, uh, I will go and calculate uh, how much I earn for this uh, treasure chest. La. Wow, I got another treasure chest today. Okay, so I'm going to do the second one as well. Uh, it took me some time to reach the place. Uh, however, the good thing was that uh, the food was already ready. So I've already packed and let's go and deliver the food. There's a lot of uh, grab food delivery riders right now. Eh? So don't know whether all of them uh, also have the treasure map. But uh, from what I understand is that uh, not everybody gets at the same time. Eh? Uh, only selected people will get at certain times. Eh? So, or maybe it's also because, you know, now it's lunch time. Uh. Uh, this time round, uh, it's actually $4.70. Uh, so, 
I think with the treasure map zone thingy, right? Uh, I think I should get another 60 gems, uh, if I'm not mistaken. So there should be an additional three dollars. So total will be seven seventy. Uh. Okay, let's go and deliver to this customer, and then I will calculate how much I earn. Hello, hi. I put it over here. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Enjoy your meal. Wow, I'm very scared of dogs. Huh? Uh, thankfully, I've uh, got cabinet outside. I can put the uh, food and then just run away. Wow, this customer is uh, quite nice. Uh, because uh, he, I just saw my earnings uh, screen. Uh, he actually tipped me $2. So maybe he feel guilty uh, when he saw how scared I was and I ran away after placing the food on his cabinet. Okay, so let's check out uh, how much I earned uh, for the treasure zone. Uh. So uh, remember, uh, this one is not my entire day earnings. Uh. It's just these two particular uh, pickups and drop-offs I did while inside the treasure zone. Uh. So uh, for the first job, right, I earned uh, 53 gems. Uh. Then for the second one, uh, uh, while inside the treasure zone, I earned uh, 91 gems. So that's a total of uh, 144 gems. Uh. Uh, however, uh, when I read the incentive uh, screen, right, uh, they give you a payout of uh, 5 cents per gem for this uh, treasure zone. So what happens is that uh, the minimum, right, or the, 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 the rounding up number which they give out the gems is at 60 gems. So 60 gems is at uh, $3.00. So out of the 144 gems I collected, right, uh, 120 is eligible. Uh, so 120 is uh, $6 uh, additional uh, on top of the earnings that I got from uh, GrabFood for the deliveries which I performed. So the total uh, for the two treasure zone uh, deliveries that I did uh, together with the earnings and the gems is at uh, $15.80. Uh, so there you have it, my experience with GrabFood's treasure zone, treasure chest. If you like my channel, uh, subscribe right now would be so awesome for me.